Hello and welcome. This video is brought to you by the StreamingAdvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. What we're looking at is finally a way to mirror on the Roku Ultra. Roku Ultra is Roku's top device at the moment, but when it came out, its operating system did not allow Windows and Android mirroring. What we're going to show you is Windows mirroring and what you have to do to get it done. So you're going to start here in settings and you have to make sure you have the latest update or at least up to I believe 7.5.2 okay so we have 7.5.1 so that's when the mirroring started if you have the operating system later than that 7.5.2 or 8 you should be good to go but regardless, you want to check and make sure you have the latest update. And we are up to date. If you don't have 7.5.1, you will not be able to do mirroring. So this is a very, very important first step. Check to make sure that you have the latest software. And we've done that. So now, Let's say you already realize that you've got that software. You, could, you should still check, but starting from the home menu, you're again going to go to the settings menu. You're going to go down to system. You might think it would be display type, but that just controls you know, high definition and so on. You go to system, go to the next menu, and you'll notice if you've done your update right, that now under language is screen mirroring and simple step you want to make sure that your screen mirroring is enabled and it is you know you might find that it's unenabled at disable but regardless you go into screen mirroring you want to make sure the screen mirroring is enabled and what you're going to do now is you've got to do a little work on your computer because that's what you're going to mirror in the first place. So we're going to jump onto the laptop and show you what you do from there on a Windows, at least on a Windows 8.1 operating system. Okay, so once you have selected mirroring on the Roku, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your computer, which we have done here. This is my laptop. It's running Windows 8.1 you're going to go in and you need to find your devices menu in this case you go down to your right corner and it's going to automatically pull these guys up here you select devices you go to project and you're going to add a wireless display so you go to add wireless display you click it it's going to open up this settings screen here and you see it searches for your devices and in our case we got a couple of Roku's around here huh we're going to choose the Roku Ultra and so now it's going to connect with the Roku Ultra you see the projector thing there and it's going to connect on the other side with the Roku and put our screen in play. Back to the Roku screen you're gonna see the little purple menu thing pop up or the little section it shows that it is starting from my laptop and now there we are we are in we are looking at my computer via the Roku looks pretty good actually pretty clear and uh, you know you want to get out of it you go back to your corner say whoop, come on there devices project and disconnect and you're back in your Roku so that is how you do mirroring on the Roku Ultra I think that that's pretty cool I'm, I'm glad to see that you know that feature is finally there so if you like this video, please subscribe. Please share it if you can. 
and let's keep on teaching people how to stream and break past that 9,000 subscriber mark. We're very, very, very close. Very excited. I'm Ryan Downey, the Streaming Advisor. Stream on, my friends.